I wanted to talk about why we make the choices we do. When we say that we want to lose weight and we make choices that aren't helping support that decision. So this morning I was overwhelmingly wanting to go to Starbucks and get the usual non-fat, no whip mocha, which is a not as bad as a regular mocha, but not definitely not something that you want to be drinking while you're trying to lose weight. And so as we go through this process, really thinking about the mind, that we have to change our mind in order to ever one, get the weight off, and two, keep it off forever. So I started thinking about, I stopped, we call it stop, challenge, and choose. So I stopped and thought, why do I really want this mocha? And when I thought about it, it really came back to, for my husband and I, we really started hitting up the local Starbucks. Six years ago, when I first started this program to lose weight, and we started exercising with a group of people doing a spin class four times, three times a week with them. And on Saturdays, we would all go to the local Starbucks and I would have this as a treat. That was my one treat a week. And I so love that time in our life, that emotional connection that we had with other people, the friendships that we were building, um, feeling healthier. It was just a really, really good time in life. And so what's happened now is I noticed what I stopped and thought was when I drink that drink, it reminds me of those times. So I'm using that as a crutch to try to enjoy those memories. Well, I don't need to do that. I can enjoy those memories and I can build new ones with having just a plain basic Americano with sugar-free caramel in it or just a plain Americano, a coffee. I don't need to go back to that other drink. But in my challenge and my choice today, what I decided is for the next eight or 10 weeks why I'm on the program to really get myself mentally through the beginning struggles of getting back to a healthy lifestyle is my choice is that I need to not even go there. I need to just stay away so I don't have to make that choice. We have so many choices throughout the day that we have to make. Should I have this? Should I do this? Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? And we should all over ourselves. Oh, that probably didn't sound very good. Um, but I can have a coffee, but that's not what I want right now. And so for right now to get through and get my mental clarity set to do what I want to do, what I really want to do to get myself healthy is I've made the choice that I'm just not going to go there right now. So I hope this helps you to stop yourself when you come to a choice that you're, that is not the best choice in your interest. Challenge yourself. Do I really want to do this? And why do I want to do this? And then make the choice. At least if you make the choice by doing that, you know it's not a mindless choice that you did, but you actually stopped yourself and made that choice yourself. 